I think during the planning process for Lake Point, uh, the Musco lighting system was probably from the very beginning. I, I, I knew they were the biggest player in the industry. We knew that they had a great product. And we just thought uh, if, if we don't at least look at the Musco line of lighting, then, then we're, we're missing out. So we're, we were excited to take a look. And then after that, uh, it was an absolute got to have. Clearly we had interest in the type of facility. It's a, it's a one of a kind, it's a state of the art, it's a premier play, uh, high end. Technically it had interest to us and they wanted to do the right things, things that had never been done in, in uh, this level of play. But probably what interested us the most were the people. We met the owners, uh, we met their primary tenant, Perfect Game, and they were people we really liked and felt like we could do business with and that they were willing to invest in doing, it the, doing the right things for the first time for the right reasons. Musco Lights as a partner has been nothing but professional. They have been with us every step of the way from the planning to the design to the, uh, the cost benefit analysis from the individuals that have come down and, and stayed with us and talked to every one of the engineers we've had. They've been out here testing, they've been with the athletic uh, side of the equation with Perfect Game, our, our major tenant in this, uh, to our volleyball tenant and it's, it's been a pleasure, it's a professional relationship and it's one I wouldn't trade for anything. We've been amazed. Um, when you stand at home plate and you look out to center field and there's no glare, but yet the field is totally bright and the, the way that the, the white of the ball um, pops and uh, just everything, uh, they look amazing. We've done a lot of LED. We've been working LED since 2008 when we did the White House. We've done a lot of non-sports. Um, facilities, uh, large area, lower light levels. This is the first time we felt like economics really started to make sense for, uh, for a sporting facility. Um, the technology has reached a level where the lumens per watt is high enough. Uh, the cost of the product is beginning to make more sense in comparison to HID. And, and the owners wanted to do something different and unique. And, and we've created a application and a result here that really changes how uh, athletic fields will be lit uh, using LED. It's, uh, it's not just better energy efficiency, it's better environmental impact. Uh, we're taking light out of, the, out of the surrounding area, we're putting it on the field, we're putting it in an area where tracking the flight of the ball is better. Um, so overall it's, it's a better system, but, but we're also using many of the foundational things that Musco has used for a long time, lights, structure, electrical. The, the same basic light structure components are being used in combination with LED to provide an even more enhanced uh, result. The vision of Light Point is the, uh, the, you know, the world's grandest, safest, most fun place for youth athletes to come and play and stay and just enjoy their sport and, and bring a little bit about uh, the culture of sports back to sportsmanship and, uh, and, and, and good values and we're going to play on the best fields under the best lights. We're going to provide a place for the whole family to come and have a great time. They cared a lot about making sure they put a, a facility in here that had the least amount of impact on the environment, surrounding area. Uh, that was probably number one. Cost of operation was big to them. Uh, with LED, we're able to um, reduce the amount of energy required on game levels, and then we're also able to dim it to substantially lower levels in between games. We're able to shut it off, turn it right back on. That was important to them. And then the third thing was they wanted to put an environment together for the athlete on the field that was better than anything that's available today. And we have achieved that. We have put together a playability aspect with the uplight and the really good control of the glare and spill light that we have an environment that a player has never seen before. They're able to track the ball more effectively. They have less glare for the fielder, less glare for the batter. We want to have a good environment for the athlete on the field. We want to have a good environment for the fan and we want to be environmentally friendly, both surrounding area and then just how much energy we, we consume on the system. And, and we believe LED is here today in many cases and will provide a better solution and clearly it's the future for sports lighting. Well, we have 12 more fields coming on board and uh, they'll all be Musco too and we wouldn't have it any other way.